Welcome to MC Homesteads. This is my property I bought here in 2018. Um, it's 39 acres. We've had it logged, and as you can see, it's a disaster coming in here. We've been doing a little cleanup. Um, I bought some machinery to help me with this. Uh, over there is where we're going to build the house. And as you can see, the loggers left it in total disarray. It looks like uh, tornadoes come in here and had a dance party. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna build us a, a barn dominium here. Um, the house is gonna be roughly around 2,000 square foot uh, with about that size of a shop on it. We've got a lot of work to do. We've got, uh, there's a lot to be done here. Uh, my, my name is Mark, by the way. And uh, this is my wife, Carrie. Hey, everyone. And this is my kiddos over here. Got them uh, doing a little work. So I guess it's getting time to do some work out here today. So we'll see what we got to do. All right, this is my uh, Bobcat I purchased. Uh, it's a 1977 632. Uh, it's old, but I'm hoping that I uh, get the work out of it and maybe get some of this done. Um, I purchased this uh, grappling bucket for roots and rocks. It's gonna be a big hand to me because that way I don't have to get off and on of the uh, machine to pick up limbs, which I had this bucket right here, which it didn't do. It didn't. It, it's good for scooping dirt, but that's about it. With limbs and stuff, it just you you're not doing nothing. So uh, let's uh, get this thing crunk up, and uh, hopefully it'll crank here and start doing a little work here on it. It's really the first day I've been in the uh, Bobcat for any length of time, and that is the first time I've used that grapple there. I purchased that from a local tractor place for uh, $1,200. All them buckets and hydraulic uh, fluids and things like that, that was all there by the loggers. They just threw everything in that wood pile and I unearthed uh, there probably two and a half, three bags of garbage that we had to pick up. The uh, logger sure did leave me in a mess. As y'all can tell there, I'm not no uh, professional skid steer operator. This is probably the most time I've spent behind the sticks of a skid steer. 
and I'm hoping this little uh, 632 here is going to do me a lot of good, a lot of work, because I sure do have a lot. I uh, appreciate y'all coming along and watching. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed.
done about all I can handle today. Reason why I was moving all of this here, this stuff that way, I'm trying to get away from the trees here so that when I burn this pile here, uh, it don't kill them trees. But we've got a lot of work to do and I uh, hope y'all enjoy watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. Thank you.